What's going on guys? My name is Green Sniper and welcome back to the Sniper's Nest. Um I swear to god every time I try to record a video with Ikiri today it has not gone good. <laughs> I've been trying to record free for all and for some reason I keep on running into te like t people that would just team up on me and it's not been very fun. So hopefully this game goes good. And I don't get teamed up on... Oh, that's a Seraph. I don't know what you're doing. So, the last game I just played against, and I recorded it, but I tossed it in the bin because it was pointless. My kills kept getting stolen. <laughs> I had like 5 mil damage at the end of it, and... Every kill that I had just kept getting yoinked from somebody, so I was like, man, screw this. And I tossed it. Pretty sure you guys would have liked to see it, though. There was a lot of rage on my end. See, that's the one weakness with the Kiri. If, if I go up against a Typhon and they lock me down or suppress me, I am done, dude. They can kill me so quick. And that's a crisis. This guy should not have shot at me. Because now he ba he made a big mistake. I'm running Shield Breaker on here, by the way. Just because uh, the Shield Breaker has been helping me out a lot. I go up against a ton of Ophians. I don't know why he decided to shoot there. That's a Ravana. Uh, the way I kind of want to play the Curie is long range. No, oh, that guy's already already leaving the game. Um, you kind of want to play it more long range than you do close range, because long range is where this excels. I'm trying to get that guy. He's so far away. Everybody else is... They're all fighting over here. Nobody wants to come over on my side. So, you know what? If they don't want to come to me, I'll go to them. Where's this guy going to spawn? Oh. Right there. Is that a... That's a lynx. It's a dead lynx. Man, this guy keeps getting the worst spawns ever. So I'm not going to use Shield Breaker, only because he's, like, riding cover over here. And then we're just going to run at him. This guy's probably going to quit the game. Here, we'll do this. We'll toss those around the corner here. And then go this way. And this is where I'll use Shield Breaker. Toss my turrets down. And there we go. See, if I had used Shield Breaker earlier, that would have messed me up. It's a Fafnir, so we're just going to wait it out, and then, then we'll get him. See, now we got the whole lobby on me. Got this Indra shooting me from afar. This guy's coming up here. We've definitely made that guy angry. That's for sure. Uh, this is a... That's a lynx. He's running away. This guy can't get me if I do that. Then I throw those over the corner here. He wants to kill me. He wants to kill me bad. You can see him. Okay, we're going to go after these guys. Keep on looking at this dude, because he is targeting me. But the fight's over here, so that's where we want to go. Um, phase shift would be the better option for this, by the way. 
I don't recommend running Shieldbreaker, but because I've been running into so many Ophians, um, I put Shieldbreaker on to kind of counter them. I was also debating putting uh, Quantum Radar on this, but I don't run into enough Lynxes for it to be useful. Now we're going to back away because he does have his ability. And then get him now. Ugh. Come here. Okay, he might kill us. He might kill us. We got three seconds. Two. Never mind, we got him. Oh, that's a Newton. Okay, well the Newton's gonna kill us for sure. Maybe make sure we get in 600 meters. And drop my turrets. If I can kill a Newton with this, that would be impressive. Nope, this Rook's gonna come in and steal it. See what I mean? Like, all of my kills recently have just been stolen. Like, I do all of the work, none of the reward. I can easily take down a Rook, by the way, with this setup. Like, a Rook... A Rook can't do nothing, because these turrets deal so much damage. This guy's gonna have to fight me. I don't know why he's running away. I even scare rooks, apparently. Oh, he's getting up into a little hiding spot. Okay, I see how it is. Well, we're going to go to the left side here so I can avoid his his little spot that he wants to hide at. He's using the rockets. He's very bad at aiming them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he suppressed us. That doesn't really mean much. Because then I'm going to toss Caesar on the corner. Lock him down. The turrets are going to do all the damage. And then I got four seconds left until I get another ability. So I'll toss those around. Break his shield. Stop him from healing. And then Mothership. <laughs> Can't believe the Mothership killed him. That's so funny. I'm using the base Mothership, by the way. So this thing really, it sucks. I'm using Dreadnought. Kind of at this point, it's like a meme on my channel. I don't want to get a new one. I don't really feel like I need a Mothership to be good. So I just haven't bothered. This guy made a huge mistake even trying to attempt that. I'm not sure what he's in, though. So I don't want to push him if I don't know what he's in. He does have rust weapons, though. So that leads me to believe it might be something I don't want to get close to. I do have full stacks on all my, I think, my repair amps. Is that, is that an Ocho? It kind of looks like an Ocho. It is. Wow, I can't believe I had an Ocho just completely running away from me. Okay, we're going to toss those around the corner here. He's face shifting. See, this is where face shift on my end would have been better to run. But it doesn't really matter. We've got 30 seconds left in this. Ocho's not going to push me. The guy's playing really passively in an Ocho for an Ocho player. It's kind of weird. I'm not really used to it, but I guess since it got nerfed, this guy doesn't really want the smoke, so... It's all fun and games until the Kiri comes over here on your nerfed bot. <laughs> Look at him, he's still running away. It's fine, I got first place, he got second. 
That's all that matters. We showcased why the Kiri is going to be the next meta. Man, I love running this thing. It's so fun to use, but let's check out the score here. And uh, we got 5.3 mil. Other guy got 7 kills, 3.3. Um, we'll check out his hangar real quick before I end the video. He is running a maxed Ocho with max weapons on it, so... And that's a level 90 Rook. I was kind of wondering, like, no wonder I could kill his Rook so quick, because it's kind of low level. But if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to leave a like, and consider subscribing if you are new. I appreciate all of you guys. Thank you so much. I'm pushing to 2k subs, so any help would be greatly appreciated. And, yeah, that's going to be the end of the video. I hope you guys have an amazing day or night, wherever you are, and I will talk to you all later. Peace.